Yeah, Shira, we are still in winter for about another two months, but once those temperatures start to get warmer, we start thinking about all those outdoor activities, including being on the water. So I talked with Ryan Hedrick today. He's the water operations lead with the Bureau of Reclamation. That's the entity that controls water levels in our reservoirs for much of the year. Hedrick says overall, the storage in the Boise River system is above average at 108%. The overall levels of the system are important, but where the water is, is also important. So you might see that levels in Lucky Peak look low, but those levels are all part of the Bureau of Reclamation strategy. This year at Anderson Ranch, we have a very high carryover, and that's where much of our water is currently. It's better to have the water higher in the system. We can move that water down. We cannot move the water back up into the system. So that's why we prefer to hold most of our storage or most of our water in the, in the higher system. Hedrick adds, you could also see levels at Lucky Pete start to come up around early March, but the timing could change depending on weather conditions. Right now, officials are providing minimal flow for fish and wildlife on the river. And I just want to show you briefly where reservoir levels are at right now in comparison to last year. The blue line is this year. The red line is the average, and the green line here at the bottom shows the levels last year. You can see that at the start of the water year last year, the levels were very low. So starting out in fall of 22, 2022, it's a much higher starting port point than the year before, which helps us to set up for a full irrigation season. In 2021, the irrigation season was cut short. Shira, a lot could change with our weather conditions, but for now, things are looking promising for the reservoirs. All right.